Hey, what's up? This is Andy from MyTechMethods.com. In this video, I'll show you how to copy music from an iPod, iPhone, or iPad to your computer. And this doesn't just copy music, it can copy any file from your device, whether it's a picture, video, app, or a song. You can copy anything from your iPhone, iPod, or iPad to your computer. So let's say your computer crashed and you lost everything in iTunes on your computer, but it's still on your device, your iPhone, iPod, or iPad, and you need to copy all the stuff from your device back to your computer so you can have it in both places again. This is how you're going to do it. This works on Windows computers. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have iTunes installed. So if you don't have it, just go to apple.com slash iTunes and you can download it for free from there. So download that and install iTunes on your computer. The next thing you want to do is click the link in the video description below. It'll look like this. So click on that and that will start a free instant download of the Leo iTransfer program, the program that you're going to use to copy all the files from your iOS device back to your computer. Once the download is complete, go to your downloads folder and double click to run and install the iTransfer program. Once the installation is complete, you're going to open up the iTransfer program. Now the free trial version will let you copy up to 100 files from your device to your computer. So if you only have 100 files to copy, then you can use this totally for free. If you have more than 100 files, just go up to the help button here and then choose register and you can purchase a registration code that you can copy unlimited files from your device to your computer. Okay, the next step is to connect your iPhone, iPod or iPad to your computer using the USB cable. Now once your device is connected, if iTunes comes up, just minimize it. Now in the iTransfer program, you should see your device pop up here in the left hand side column. So click on your device. Okay, so here's my iPad, it's connected. And now I can copy the music from my iPad to my computer very easily. So I just go into the music section. It's all selected by default. So if I wanna go ahead and copy all my songs from my iPad to iTunes on my computer, I can just click this arrow button on the bottom right, transfer button. Here it shows all the songs that I'm gonna copy. If you see iTunes in this list, you can go ahead and click transfer now. But if you don't see iTunes, you just click this save to folder button and then you can go to change. Since you already have iTunes installed, you can save it to a special folder called automatically add to iTunes, which will automatically copy and add the songs to iTunes once you copy them to your computer. So here's how to get to that folder. It'll be under your profile name, then under my music, then iTunes, then iTunes media and automatically add to iTunes folder should be in there. And just choose that folder and click OK. Now you don't have to save your files to that folder. If you wanna choose another folder, you can just choose whatever folder you want. But I just like to save it there because it makes it a little bit easier. So once you have your folder selected that you wanna copy the music to, just hit transfer now. Okay, and once the copy is complete, you can open up iTunes. If you saved it to the automatically add to iTunes folder, it will automatically be in iTunes. All your songs will be in iTunes now. Now, if you saved it to another folder, just go to that folder and all your songs will be there. So that's it, folks. That's how you copy music from an iPhone, iPod, or iPad to your computer. Very easy to do. Very awesome program. Again, the link is in the description below. That's Leo iTransfer. Go ahead and get that. And again, it doesn't just copy music. It can copy any file from an iPhone, iPod, or iPad to a computer. If this video helped you out, make sure you give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel for more helpful videos like this in the future. And leave a comment in the comment section below and let me know how many files that you copied using the iTransfer program. Thank you so much for watching. Keep having fun out there. I will talk to you later. Bye.